On Friday, well over 24,000 set a record for an opening night at Rupp Arena. And it looks like every bit of that many have crammed into Rupp Arena once again as the Cats look to go 2-0 on the regular season as they take on the Red Hawks of Miami University. Winbush. And now they swing it around. That's Haddix, the Scott County product, who's been on fire from outside the three-point line. And even though he's played in this building in the Sweet 16, he misses his first tray. Patterson has all of a sudden become a three-point threat. Him on the offensive end. Bledsoe with a fake, and now Wall with the open jumper. That's not the strength of his game, but that is a good sign for the Cats as Kentucky is now two of two from outside the arc. Well, that was fine. Let's see if he pulls up. Not this time. Good, quick hands by John Wall. The freshman who's known so much for his offense got a hand on it, knocked it off the leg of Hayes and creates the turnover. Yeah, good quickness that time. Miami had used the clock, though, to back down within that single digits before John Wall came up with that deflection off his leg. Approaching the two-minute mark in his first half of play. And Dotson. Two for two from the field. Two of two from downtown. And what that does, it not only opens up the drive, but now up some of those low post moves for Patrick Patterson as well. He can continue to knock down the threes. And it opened up the crowd to get back on their feet. See Kentucky now switching all two-man games. Before they were trying to go underneath, now they're switching. Good help that time by Josh Harrelson. Hayes with a penetration. And Wall starts the break. Oh, what a hanging pretty move by John Wall. Taze just inside the three-point line. He got going early. And then Winbush kind of took, took over. But uh, Hayes with nine points. And Orton draws the foul. Five in the four man will step out and win Bush. Kentucky not doing a good job staying down defensively. Oh, they got away with the goaltend that time, although the ball might not have been above the rim. And they call the block. It looked like a clean block by Mabunga. The foul was called there. I believe they whistled that on Mabunga. And if that's the case, that's his fourth. And he'll go to the bench. Replaced by number 41, Adam Fletcher. You know, Mavunga and Fletcher, both of those players, if you look at them, really the, the atypical inside players in the MAC. Very physical players, maybe a little bit undersized, but really strong. Hayes got it inside to Fletcher. And he couldn't finish. A real important now, Kentucky to build on that defensive stop again. Come down, dig in, to the full 35. Not. And Soderbergh with a quick shot that Patterson pulls off the miss. And Darius Miller, the cry has been for him to step up. He got the first basket of the game. Bledsoe to Wall. To go. Well, whatever it is they said on that bench, uh, he absorbed it, he used it to his advantage, and it really came into play, did a great job. Oh. Boy, Haddix, Haddix committed the foul, and Miller, he is 9 of 12 from the line tonight. And will be shooting two. And again, to speak to the total nature of his game, Kyle, you know it better than anybody. 
the kid doesn't go to the socks yet, but the guy who's handling the basketball in these late game situations, you want him to be able to knock down the free throws. Yeah, that's right. And, and as you said before that free throw, nine of uh, 11, 12. 12, yeah. So one of your better free throw shooters, which is a good thing. And that's why, probably why he didn't pass the ball once Kentucky got possession in the two point lead. Just tried to use as much floor before he got fouled. And that one rattles off, and Miami with a basketball. They have been on fire from outside the arc. 14 of 25. Winbush has hit eight threes himself. Well, you want to make sure oh, you can't give a guy a shot. You got to make sure you switch and extend out. The tie and now Wall for the win. No timeouts for Miami. No foul. Oh, my goodness. He was the number one recruit in all of college basketball. And in his first official game as a Wildcat, John Wall knocks down the jumper to give Kentucky a 72-70 win. Well, Kentucky made the mistake giving up the three, but John Wall comes down and does what he has to do to get the win for the Wildcats. Cats a little bit fortunate, though. No foul called once the ball was in bounds. There will be lots of talk about that, but there will be plenty of talk about that young man. 